Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I have an Allure Sample Society unboxing. It's from Beauty Bar. Um, so let's get right in. Okay, so you open it up and there's a little pamphlet, which I'm guessing, yeah, has the stuff inside, but I'm not going to look at that so that I can be surprised too. And then you open this up and lots of little samples in here. Let's see what we got. Okay. So this is um, Philosophy Renewed Hope in a Jar, Refreshing and Refining Moisturizer. Let's see. Uh, it's gonna go. No, maybe you can see it like that. I'll have pictures of all this stuff on my blog, so it'll be better to see. Um, I am a little bit nervous about using this because I used the Philosophy I Hope before and I had a extreme allergic reaction and my eyes just like the moisture was sucked out of them and had to go to the dermatologist. So a little bit scared of using this. I might give this to a friend. Um, let's see what's up next. Revlon Photo Ready Eye Art. This would have come in handy for the holidays. Looks very, very glittery. Let's see if this will open easily. It looks like you put, I guess that's the shadow stick. This is um, the shade Peach Prism, by the way. And then this is glitter, which I guess you put on top. Yeah, this would have been fun for New Year's Eve. Um, definitely not an everyday kind of look, but um, it'd be fun for parties. I'll put some swatches on my blog too because it looks like the color is getting a little bit washed out and that glitter is hard to see, but that would be fun for special events. Okay, next up we have Philip B. Lightweight Deep Conditioning Cream Rinse. So this will be interesting. It says it's phthalate free, um, color and keratin treatment safe. So it should be pretty um, gentle. It doesn't have, oh, there it popped out on my finger. <laughs> there it is. It does not have a strong smell at all, um, which I like. So that'll be fun to try. Perfect little travel size to keep um, in your bag for when you go on vacation. Get rid of that real quick. Okay. Next up, we have a nail polish. This is Zoya, which I don't, I might have tried one Zoya nail polish before. So I'm excited about this. Um, this is in Leslie. It's a really pretty, I would say, like, classic lavender. Um, I don't see any shimmer either, so we'll have to see when it applies to my nails. It might look differently. So maybe I'll paint my nails and post a picture on my blog for y'all to see. Okay, next up is Teeny Tiny Bar of Soap. <laughs> it says Sea Mud Deep Cleansing Bar. I guess it's for your body? I don't know. I have sensitive skin, so I'm probably not going to use it on my face. Um, we'll see how that goes. And last but not least, a Strivectin Intensive Illuminating Serum. Boosts skin's clarity for a brighter, more even complexion. Brighten and perfect. I've never tried anything Strivectin, so... That'll be interesting to try. Um, it's a little bitty serum like this. It's a pretty good size for a sample. I think that's pretty generous. I don't know. Let's see what the consistency is like. Okay, so it's it's got a little thickness to it. It's not like super runny like a lot of serums are. I would say it feels like a lightweight moisturizer. Like real lightweight. Kind of has like a citrusy smell, which I do like, so I'll have to give that a shot. 
Okay, so that's everything that's in the um, box for this month. I will be getting this for five more months after this. So in my next video, when I unbox the February box, I'll have my views on this month's box. Um, and if I do end up giving this to a friend, I'll make sure to check in with them and see what they thought. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. Um, please subscribe down below and like this video if you did. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye. I have a Allure Sample Society. Oh, that's upside down.